Hi Taurus, this is Sandy Couture and I am here doing the astrological tarot reading for the sign of Taurus for the month of December 2022. So we've been living in an interesting year this year. There's been a lot of um, oh uncertainty about moving forward because we've had so many planets in retrograde at the same time. And right now things are starting to shift. We have planets that are moving direct. Jupiter is moving direct in the first couple of days of December, um, as is uh, Neptune moving direct. And uh, Venus and Mercury have moved into Sagittarius. It's the Sagittarius season. It's Sagittarius is ruled by Jupiter and Jupiter is about expansive hopefulness, like joviality, new beginnings. So um, usually Sagittarius season gives everybody t a type of a little uplift, even if it's not necessarily clear why or how. So, um, but one of the big players, Mars, is still retrograde. This has been a very long, unusually, excuse me, long, um, retrograde in Mars for Mars and it's in Gemini so it's actually opposing uh, Sagittarius opposing all that joviality all that uh, bursting forward is Mars going whoa slow down uh, take a look inside and really that's what it's all about it's about taking a look inside before you take big action and not just taking a look but listening to your internal dialogue your inner voice your inner guidance ask for help and listen to the answers that's what's going on for us now it's kind of like we've been driving in a fog and we know we have a destination but all we can see is what's in front of our face and it's a little disconcerting but that will all start to shift and change not this month but by the end of january we will all be in a much more forward position so the first card that i pulled for you taurus is the eight of wands wands are an action card and these wands appear to be flying through the air and um, what that really tells me is you have something in the works something that you have been wanting and moving towards is actually moving towards you at the same time you may not be able to see it in the 3d yet but it is coming to you energetically the surprise or challenge position card is the wheel of the year and the Wheel of the Year is like the Wheel of Fortune in other decks. It's about taking the spin. Move forward. Go for it. Um, it's coming to you. So get ready for it to come to you. Do what you need to do to accept it. The uh, Process card is the Emperor card. And the Emperor is like the male authority of the universe in the Tarot deck. He's benevolent, the all-knowing and, and giving father. So you have a lot of um, support from the world of action. You know, masculinity is what does, femininity is what births and what creates. So to put those two together, you do need the action part and that's your job this month. Be ready for what's coming, get yourself ready to accept and then move and do what you need to do. But always listening to your internal voice, please. And the most likely outcome is the Knight of Cups. Cups is a water card about emotions. Uh, but this Knight is very masculine and this cup is about um, creativity and joining together the feminine and the masculine internally to be balanced in your forward movement. You know, this is a beautiful night standing by a creek of water, emotion that's, you know, and on the green grass that's very feminine, yet he is very masculine. So Taurus is an earth sign. Um, we're asking you to know things are coming to you, to take action in the knowing, to um, understand that you are supported by all of the powers that be, and to allow the um, burst of creative combination of masculine and feminine in your outcome. So hopefully that was helpful for you Torians out there. And I hope you have an absolutely wonderful holiday, no matter how you worship or who you worship. Thank you so much for watching and bye now.